Hi Beachview students, Mrs. Atkins here, back with another Second Step lesson. I just want to say thank you to all of you who keep watching these videos and thank you to all you students because I know you're working really hard and trying to get your work done and I know it's not easy doing that from home, but I do want to say thank you for all the times you try to get your work done and you come to meets and you do the right thing. So thank you, give yourself a pat on the back and here is our lesson for today. We met Mateo last lesson. He is anxious about his math test. It is a really strong feeling that he is having. Use your hand to make a model of the, your brain again. Remember, your thumb represents the feeling part of your brain and your fingers cover your thumb and they represent the thinking part of the brain. Mateo is feeling uncomfortable. He notices his hands are sweaty, his face is hot, and his heart is beating very fast. He feels a little sick to his stomach. These sensations or body feelings tell him that his brain is not thinking clearly. Mateo is having a strong feeling. It is hard for him to think. He wants to run out of the classroom and hide so he doesn't have to take the test. He needs to find a way to manage or control his strong feelings. Let's look at this calm down poster together. First, Mateo needs to stop and give himself a signal like chill out or relax. Then he needs to name how he's feeling. He needs to say, I'm feeling really anxious to himself. He could whisper it or just think it in his brain. Finally, Mateo needs to use a strategy to calm down. He can use deep breathing, slow counting, or positive self-talk. What strategy do you think Mateo should use? Deep breaths, slowly breathing in through the nose, out through the mouth. Do you think he should use slow counting? One, two, three, and all the way on up till 10. What about positive self-talk? Mateo could say to himself, this is not a big deal. I can figure this out. All of these are good choices. Mateo could even use them all together. He could take deep breaths while he was counting and then use some positive self-talk and say, I can do this, I can do this. What strategy do you think you would like to use when you need to calm down? There's no right or wrong answer. You just need to pick the one that you like the best. I like to use positive self-talk to calm down. It helps me put things in perspective. We are going to conclude our lesson today by watching our Calm It Down music video. Let's review the calm down steps one more time. Stop, name your feeling, calm down using a strategy. Okay, here is our music video. Hey guys, I'm here with some friends today and we're gonna show you how to do the calm it down dance. It's simple and it's fun. First, let me give you the basics. The chorus goes, stop, name your feeling, Calm down. All right, I'm gonna show you the moves that go with that. It is stop, name your feeling, calm down. Good, I'm gonna show you again. Here we go. Stop, name your feeling, calm down. Good, now try it with us. All right, here we go. Stop, name your feeling, calm down. Great, and for the rest of the dance, well, just follow along with us. 
First, I need you guys to get into a robot pose. Ready for some music? You're feeling brain takes hold and you could flip your lid. Stop, you've got to think it through. Just calm it down like this. Stop and name your feeling calm down. 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 Feeling calm down. Every day we can have strong feelings, strong emotions that send us reeling. But there are steps we can take to calm down. These are the keys to turn things around. Just stop. Your feeling. Turn on your brain. Start thinking, not just feeling. Calm it down. Do some breathing. Calm it down. And some counting. One, two, three, four. Calm it down. Use self talk. I can do it. I can do it. And keep thinking. Stop. Name what you're feeling now and take some belly breaths. Say good things to yourself. Count and and calm the feeling down. Stop and name your feeling calm 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 down. down. Say someone bumps you and you drop your stuff. You can't think clearly, you're feeling rough. Just say stop, name what you're feeling Take back your powder, and throw it at the ceiling Stop, name what you're feeling now And take some belly breaths Say good things it. to I yourself Count and calm the feeling down Stop and name your feeling calm 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 down